good morning ladies and gentlemen welcome to channel 48 i'm here with my samsung galaxy s10 and i'm connecting a little extension to it it's a usb-c to normal usb converter i'm doing this because i'm not getting an mtp connection in my linux machine that i'm using at this moment what you're looking at is the new build of Samsung One UI OS 64 bit that must still be released. But before I'm gonna release that, we first. Oh boy, wait, hold on. This phone has one issue it needs to be connected to a computer before trying to go into download mode or recovery mode that will be volume of big C and power you see the logo you release it and we're gonna let it go to recovery mode and I'm gonna push in this here I already did a, a cleanup a wipe so I'm now gonna just, just gonna install from OTG And that won't work it will be detected during a reboot back into recovery at least I hope I see no flashing of the hard drive Look, 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 it's flashing. It mounted! And I just unmounted it again. Okay, we are mounted finally. Sometimes you must get a little bit mad, then suddenly it works. Okay. So, install image. There you go. Pixel 14. And this is the first beta one that we're gonna flash peeps not knowing if it's gonna work if it's gonna boot this is the latest build that was released last night released on the 12th 04 2023 and today it's let me see what day it is today today is 13 so this was released last night yesterday and thanks to nippon our nippon friends from palestine a new build was released and we are very grateful to this group and very proud of them that every month they bring us these latest builds and in between a whole lot of GSIs that we never ever heard of. So a big, great appreciation goes to Nippon, Nippon GSI together, of course, with the usage of the Ervan tools by Ervan. And Erfan is not so active at this moment because he's very busy with his medical study. Study medical. So this guy is gonna become some doctor or so. Alright. And he as well figured out how to make a nice tool that others can use to make GSIs in the world that is nippon the only one they can hit their self on the on their breast because i don't see no other not an individual and not a group really doing this for the community most people that run android 14 now is thanks to nippon if it's not some android phone that uh, some google phone that they have honestly thanks to Nippon and to nobody else 
and Google, of course. Google for the releasing, Nippon for the for the for the creating, and that is something that at least I am very grateful for. You know, here on my channel, channel forty eight. It's all about what these guys release and what they have for us that we can show to you so you can as well do magic out there sometimes it takes a while to find out how things work and then we get the help from an unexpected corner and this year that was our friends from Magisk And they made it possible to make these things boot. Thank you. So now, let me see. I should have my disk on internal storage one. There it is. And we're gonna flash it. And the effect we should now as well format data but we're gonna try without formatting data to reboot because if that will work then it will be better for me and I don't lose files that I have on my C drive but officially we should reboot yes it's gonna boot so sweet thank you Google thank you Nippon so sweet, it's gonna boot in a second. Hold on. <laughs> you see that? Google 14 beta is starting up. The first beta, ladies and gentlemen, of the upside down cake is booting up. And uh, yeah, soon we're gonna have, yeah, I think in the later builds, we're gonna get uh, a Google search with Bart built in. So. Soon our ROMs will be AI supported as well, our Pixel ROMs. So let's see if it's gonna boot. Because we're not there yet, guys. Yes, it's gonna boot. It's gonna boot. Yes, and it booted. How <laughs> can I have applause, please, ladies and gentlemen? A big applause. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. That is for Google and Nippon. For Google and Nippon. My two powerful friends that make things possible that effect would not even be possible. And Samsung, of course, is as well very proud to see that their old Samsung S10 eh, here at channel 48, thanks to the binary E, can still install Android 14. And that is painful for many to see that updated to uh, the later binaries from Samsung because they, in fact, have a problem that I don't want to have. <laughs> and I warned everybody about it. So, yeah, I cannot feel sorry afterwards eh, that you that you did not listen or did not you know and today is the 13th eh? thursday the 13th peeps and this is a lucky number 13 because here you can see that we just installed android 14 to the samsung galaxy s10 and let's see if the camera works camera works works good let's put it to video you're looking at the man himself, channel 48, sin. <laughs> Let's see if that works. Wow. That looks uh, very, 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 very neat. Um, the front camera, is it working? Let's see if it works. Oh. Hello. We must go back to camera. 
Hold on, hold on, hold on, Mr. Darlington. So we're gonna turn the cam. Yes, yes, it still works, man. It works, works fine. Let's make a nice wallpaper, nice windows wallpaper. This is a windows wallpaper, peeps. A windows wallpaper. So let's take a look at the real wallpapers of this uh, beautiful OS. Let me first make... Um, ah, never mind. Let's take it. Here you can see the styles. Yeah. You can set it to dark or light. You see, if you like light, you can put it light. You can put it dark. It gives a little error there, but hey, listen, these errors you should not care about, okay? If you're a tester, then these little errors that pop up and say effect nothing, you should not worry about them, you know? This is still, yeah, a young child. Been, this is the Turk build, so it's still crying once in a while. You know, like a little child cries out of nothing. That's how you should see these things. Not immediately start sweating. This is not the same as when your car leaks one drop oil every three minutes. Okay, so don't worry about it. Okay, the back wallpapers. Let me see. Um, Achtergrond wijzigen. Here you can see the beautiful achtergronden, ladies and gentlemen. That's how you say that in Dutch. Achtergronden. And this is a very nice wallpaper that is already uh, in the system. Nice and dark. But if you're like, hey, that is too dark for my eyes. Hey, hello. What did I do? Um, oh, yeah. Here's all the way. So I want to go to settings one more time. And in fact, I want to uh, check something. How do I, my photos here, photos allow, of course, allow all. Achtergrond and stijl, achtergrond and then photos. Hey, you see that? There's a little bug there. When you want to select your own photo from of the uh, change wallpaper, you're gonna get a little bug. Okay, but how to fix that bug? How to fix that bug? Let me show you how to do that. Um, I must always look good at these icons. I can never find a gallery. Where's the gallery? Oh, this thing has no gallery yet. Oh, that's why it's acting like that. Okay, okay, I, 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 no, I understand. So what you should do is log in with your Google account and uh, update, all right? I'm gonna do that as well. I'm gonna install my uh, my chat GPT and my applications. And then maybe later I'll come back with uh, a review of how things all work. But for now, I can be clear. Uh, you can go ahead and install Android 14, the beta one, onto your Samsung Galaxy S10. Uh, if you are as well so fortunate like me to, um, yeah, to be on uh, binary e or yeah i don't know guys really honestly um i hear many people complain about uh, not being able to install uh, android 14 but as you can see since i have my s10 i installed them all uh, before they even came to the phone and that i'm talking about 12 and later 13 and now as well 14 and 14 beta 1 and I say thank you so much, Nippon, uh, for yeah for making it work on my S10. Thank you, Magisk. Uh, thank you, uh, Google, in the very first place, of course, for creating Android 14 Beta 1 every month again and again on time. Thank you so much. I feel very, really yeah honored and proud that I can show this on my Samsung Galaxy S10. And of course, I will as well try it on my other devices. See you in the next video. If you did like this information, don't forget to leave this video a thumbs up. It helps this channel to bring the message even further to the others.